GoDaddy's back at it again. The domain registrar has been having difficulty convincing ABC to air their most recent ads in the 2006 Super Bowl next month. The news comes on the heels of GoDaddy's successful Super Bowl ad campaign last year. GoDaddy's ad featured scantily clad model Candace Michelle prancing provocatively in a parody of Janet Jackson's infamous wardrobe malfunction. Fox quickly cancelled a second ad after the network received a large number of complaints. When we spoke to GoDaddy's COO, he said that Risqué was good because it gave them the exposure they needed to get noticed. Well, you know, if we're looking at the Super Bowl commercial, we realized when we went into sort of the creative development on that commercial that in order to make... Um, have an impact at the Super Bowl, that we had to do something different. It couldn't be a run-of-the-mill commercial because, you know, there, there, there is sort of this uh, real attempt during the Super Bowl, as you know, to produce incredible commercials. So we wanted something that would really um, be able to, you know, differentiate it from the other commercials that people would see, particularly since, you know, we really only had 30 seconds to do it in. And it was our coming out party in many ways from a national perspective in terms of a brand campaign. So we uh, tried to look for something that would be both um, entertaining, amusing, but would have um, you know, resonance with people. And I think um, you know, we, were, we were lucky in being able to find that formula, and I think it, it worked very well. Obviously, it became a very controversial uh, commercial as a result of um, the decision by uh, the network to uh, pull its second airing. And that led to a lot of, um, you know, um, uh, press and interest in, in what happened. But I think it was, um, you know, a very good uh, launching point for us. Our subsequent commercials have been uh, far more uh, product oriented, and we wanted to go um, into a follow up campaign with, okay, we've been able to put the GoDaddy name into the minds of people. Now let's build on that by telling them about, you know, what do we do and what can you derive um, from us in terms of a benefit for your business. As of January 11th, GoDaddy has had nine versions of its new ad rejected by the ABC network. However, Parsons says that he's working with the president of ABC Sports to provide an ad that's acceptable to both parties as well as the Standards and Practices Committee.